And then finally, for business news, and it takes us to the world of online entertainment, we should talk about Ludwig Akron because he has officially broken Tyler Blevins's, AKA Ninja's. Sorry, sorry. Whoa, I think my speakers are fucked. Uh. And then finally, for business news, and it takes us to the world of online entertainment, we should talk about Ludwig Akron because he. Oh, oh, didn't hear that wrong. Ogred, Og, Ogred Philly. Philoop, Philoop de Frunku. Does that feel good, man? I'd imagine not. He has officially broken Tyler Blevins's, AKA Ninja's, all time sub record on Twitch. And this coming after, I don't, I don't know if you've watched this, Ludwig just finished a 31 day subathon where he was streaming live for an entire month. And it was kind of this perfect ending to a seemingly out of nowhere genius move where he would add 10 more seconds to the stream for every new subscriber he got. Yeah, invented that, invented that. Not gonna take credit, invented it though. Until he eventually announced the cutoff day this week, ultimately getting 283,000 subscribers, beating Ninja's record of 269,000. Also with these crazy sub numbers, there's been a lot of speculation about how much money Ludwig made from all of this, but th that is something that's actually really hard to break down. Right, Switch subscriptions based off of the tier, they range from $4.99 to $24.99. Some estimates saying that just off of the subscribers, he made $1.6 million dollars though that's before twitch splits See, places like dexerto so how is that even possible 1.6 million off of less than 300 000 subs you think i'm tier two out of my mind you think i'm tier three out of my mind saying that okay he got 935,000 plus right after the post twitch split ludwig's also donating 365,000 dollars his payroll 177,000 dollars for uh, people like his moderators there are of course then taxes though a lot of the the people that are doing taxes are doing it incorrectly because they're not taking into account uh, charitable donations or what he's paying and it's also not known how much he made from advertising at this time so the place is estimating that he only made 200,000 dollars from this i have doubts it's that low but also i do want to know that this is me just talking about a, a main point of speculation speculation and debate in regards to this story because I think the money that he made here actually I agree with something that Ludwig himself said whatever I would get paid is so much less valuable than the increased viewership and followers he could have made no money and still gained in the thing that is most important and that is community views are views but it's the community that will carry you on their backs for the years and potentially decades to come and there is no oh no I didn't mean that at all <laughs> I just meant that now I can just have advertisers pay me more because I have more viewership Community can suck me. <laughs> Not at all. Not at all. No, 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 no. Out of my mind that the shared experience that he's had with tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands of people with this over the last month, that's it's it's the biggest thing. That kind of ends up being the ultimate truth of this story. Like Ludwig could have lost money over the last 31 days, and it would still be a massive long-term win. And uh, I will say moving forward, it'll be interesting to see if others do this because Ludwig himself said he will not do it again, but I would be genuinely shocked if we didn't see a rise in subathons. And then let's take a second to pay some bills and thank the fantastic sponsor. You think? I don't think people do subathons. On, I mean, people do subathons, but I think uncapped subathons, we won't see that much. Today's show, Vessi. You know, it is honest. I guess Mizkif did one, Wendy did one, Moon Moon did one, or two even, I think. Jack did one. Amaranth did one. Yeah, maybe you're right. Can't what you have now. Don't count what you don't have.